Hello everybody, it's Joe here and welcome back to another episode of Cities Skylines 2. Today we're back in Sam Bradifax where in the last episode we put this amazing new road bridge in which has taken so much traffic off this particular road here. It's actually made it really not need to be as sort of wide as it is. I mean look at that, there's no cars at all. This bus lane again, probably redundant. We should have looked at doing this in the first place to be honest with you. But yeah, this road has got so much traffic going across it now. Uh, if we speed that up, you can see a lot of people wanting to go down there as it happens. I wonder why. But uh, yeah, besides that, plenty of uh, people using this bridge and uh, it does just make everything that little bit better. Now, uh, what that has meant bulldozing this new road through here is that uh, we have got quite a few green spaces in our city now. So what I'm going to do is today we're going to just look at filling those in uh, to make it a little bit more, you know, so it looks a little bit more like it's in the city. So we're going to build that to there, there we go, down there. A couple of houses can go in there, can't they? Uh, we've got another area here, maybe if we... We just do a bit of that. It's not many houses, is it? But it's just a couple, just to take up the space. And then we could have another uh, another area in here. Just build that round. You know, like a little cul-de-sac. That's absolutely fine. I mean, these seem to be the uh, the lower density round here, don't they? So we'll sling a couple of them in. Uh, these ones do seem to be a bit more high density. So we'll put a couple of them in there. A couple of them in there. It just makes it a little bit more... There we go, a bit of terraced housing on there. Just fills the gaps in, doesn't it? Now, uh, we have got plenty to do today. Uh, oh, hang on, another another bit of road there. There we go. Right, that is going to be a bit of that and uh, a bit of that as well. There we go. A couple of terraced houses on the main road. It makes sense, doesn't it? We've actually got uh, loads of demand down in the bottom corner there for high-density stuff as well. Uh, perhaps we could look at maybe... I mean, there's... Mm, I don't know... High density housing, really, really high density housing. We've got some flats here near the city hall. Didn't look as good, did it? Um, what we do also need to do is ensure that we have got enough roundabouts because people did mention, Joe, your uh, your roundabouts are uh, are the best way of uh, of getting people round junctions quickly. Trams as well, we could do with a better tram network because uh, we have only got the one tram route. I think it would be quite nice to have a, you know, I mean, this is this has obviously got the uh, the metro system underneath. I don't know how well the metro system's doing, to be honest with you. I mean, it seems to have efficiency 114%. That's good. Got a metro on there. That's got 183 passengers. So doing well. What I think I'm going to do is uh, all round here, just upgrade this to medium density. Because uh, we've got some medium density here. There we go. If we, if we go around there for the... Uh, there we go. And a bit round here as well. So if we do a bit of that... This is really going to be, because obviously now we've got less traffic on the road, we can actually play with a bit more of this, and then we'll have, uh, oh, you see, look what's happened there. Right, we'll go with a bit of this, yeah, lovely, all the way down there. This really is going to uh, knock the medium density requirements off, isn't it, to be honest with you. There we go, a bit of that, around there, lovely. Just do the whole lot, it'll be fine. There we go, and all around here as well, just the, uh, the the standard medium density, if we drag all that over. It's going to result in a lot of demolition, but this area is really going to improve, hopefully. And there we go, this side of the track's just like medium density houses, let's get it done. That's, that's what we want, right, and again, with the backs to the railway, that's a really good place for medium density housing, isn't it? Same down there, let's just make it all happen. Medium density dropping through the floor there, but again, uh, seeing as we've not got all this traffic down here, it would make sense to make it a bit more populated. You know, it's like a, a residential area just out of town. Oh, what's this? Malari Palace. Beautiful old-style building. Lifts the spirits of everyone passing by. Right, let's... Uh, what does it do? 7% well-being. Right, well, we could stick that there on the main road. Lovely. It's quite small, isn't it, really? And of course, high density housing also required. So could we, we could look at maybe, oh, you see what high density have we got? Uh, large style apartment buildings. We could have a couple of them on there. Yeah, a bit of that. That's looking good. Bit of that. See what it chucks out there. See, this is obviously quite high up. Going out of town, a couple of apartment buildings like that. Are these going to be like this? What, what was that? Can't remember what that was. Oh, what what are all these things? Oh, these are the houses that live in there. That's brilliant. Uh, 
See, that's going to increase traffic as well, isn't it? See, this, again, would make sense as a roundabout. What, what's happening with the old buses there? The bus situation. Uh, right, okay. So because of this, right, can we have a roundabout here, maybe? Is that going to work with the trams? The trams will just go straight across. That might work. What about a bigger one? Overlapping. Better. Why are these... There's, there should be no traffic jam. There's no reason for a traffic jam. Right, I mean, that is causing a hassle with all them buses, isn't it? Which has blocked... Oh, they've all despawned. Right, okay. Excellent. Right. We didn't really want you to all despawn. What's happening with this bus lane? Why is, why is nobody using it? Right, we've got... Cars down there queuing up in every direction. They all want to go down there. So if we, uh, right, we'll go for this expansion. Yeah. Oh, hang on. Can't do that. We'll have to go. Right, hang on. Yep. Yeah. Go back there. Yep. Yeah. Back over there. <laughs> right, demolish them. So this is going to be, what are these going to be? These can be the high density option. There we go. I don't know what they were before, but it can be that. Uh, and then these were commercial, weren't they? So you can can be back there, lovely. What are we... Ah, it's because that crossing's there, right. Why are people... Yeah, you see, because there's so much people here. So many people here. It's a way that we could take the crossing off, because that is causing mayhem. There we go, right. Take that crossing off there. Have it down at the other end. I don't want crossings at the end of roundabouts. There we go. Take them all off. No more crossing. Although they're all just crossing anyway. Stop crossing. You're causing absolute mayhem. See, I'd like a, like a bridge over the top. The road's just too busy, isn't it? Right, are we, uh, yeah, you see, they're still crossing, aren't they? Just, just... I mean, it solved that issue coming from there. This is also a problem, though. Oh, dear. So many cars queuing up. I don't know. Right, but what I would also like to do is I'd like to work on some of our farms outside of town. I'd like better farming. You know, so that, so that it just looks nicer. Because uh, our farms at the minute do look a little bit... They're not the nicest looking, are they? Oh, what's this up there? That's a plane. So what I'm going to do is I am going to utilise this area over here. Have we got... Yeah, so we have got some nice farming area here. That's good. So we're going to go with a bit of that because we can join up to the motorway, can't we, here? So we're going to go from this bit here. No, that doesn't make sense to do that. So that's a farm. Oh, I don't know. Could we go over the top of the ro of the railway? Would that work? No, is the answer. It's a little bit close, isn't it? Oh my lord, what's everyone queuing for? Right, another roundabout required, I think. There we go. Yeah, are we? Uh, yeah, there. Oh, that's much better. Flowing much better than uh, than with all the traffic lights. Yeah, roundabouts do just seem to be the way to go, don't they? I mean, already that's all moving. So we've got the roundabout here. I think a nice two-lane road there. If we bring that... Can we, can we just untick the snapping? There we go. Right, bring that up there. It can just be a, a proper... There, uh, straight through. Because then we can connect you to the motorway up here. Now, how do we... If we go with intersections, highways, that'll do... Oh, a fuel plant. A signature building. Uh, we don't need that just yet, do we? Right, so... Is it one? Oh, hang on. Right. No, no, uh, no clipping. There we go. Yeah, all the way along the top there. Clip it round like that. Lovely. And we shall go for... bit of that. This can all be 
single carriageway. There we go. And same again there. Lovely. And two there. That's going to work. It's going to work wonders, is that? Right, okay. And then we'll have a one coming off here. Pretty much the standard junction, isn't it, for me? There we go. Right. Oh, what have I done? There we go. You on there. Just pull that in there. Lovely. And same again. Without the uh, the clipping business on it, it really does seem to work better, doesn't it? Than, uh, than the old City Skylines game. Now, here we're going to go for... Back to uh, back to clipping. And round like this. There we go. It's going to work wonders. Now, where is our fertile land? So that's going to go through the middle here. Do we need this amount? Yes, of course we do. Right. So that can come round there like that. Yeah, lovely. And we can actually bring it all the way up here to go round the edge of this. Right, so, round here. Because, of course, we've got this little gap between. So we can use chicken farms between... Oh, hang on, where are we? Like, ag agricultural farms between the two and have, like, a massive farm area up here. I think that works. That sounds like quite a good idea, doesn't it? Yeah, I was watching a thing on the City Skylines YouTube channel which suggested making your farms just look a little bit better. You know, and I think we can do that. Right, where are we? Where's the farming? Not that one. That's the one. So, livestock farming can be done anywhere. Grain farming. Right, okay. So. Grain farming there. Lovely. Right, so if we do that, uh, there we go. Can we can we get rid of the snapping? Keep calling it clipping, don't I? But get rid of the snapping. Right, there we go. Round the corner. There we go, right, keep all that. Lovely, bit of that. Right, we'll have some vegetables here. Because this can actually, if we do that, we can go all the way around, can't we? That's going to look really, really good. Possibly, or it might look terrible, who knows? So we're going to go around there. Yeah, lovely. Now, we're going to leave a little gap between the two. And there's a reason for this. Because I think that this will look a little bit nicer if we do this. So we're going to bring that up there like that. There we go. And then what we're going to do down the middle in this gap is plant some trees. Because we all like trees, don't we? Trees are good. Trees are fantastic. What are we going to do? Pine trees. I think oak trees are going to look brilliant. So, oh, hang on. Overlapping. Oh, I need this hierarchy, anarchy business, don't I? Right, we'll have to go and download that for the next episode. But we'll leave the gaps there. Oh, no, this has done that thing. That's so annoying. Right, get rid of that. Try again. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba, where are we? Vegetables. Some of you probably noticed that, didn't you? Before I did. Right, put that round again. Right, so we'll do that again for the trees, yeah. Because we could just have them square, couldn't we? But I, I thought that was a really nice idea of the uh, of the City Skylands people and the YouTuber they were uh, collaborating with. To have little trees down it, just to make it look a bit nicer. I honestly can't imagine that there's going to be that much coming through here. That this needs to be a roundabout. But if it does change its mind later on... We can, of course, change what we're doing. Right, should we have a cotton farm over here? There we go. Right, we'll have uh, one of them as well, all the way up. Because, of course, these can be exported to make money, can't it? We'll uh, bring that back in. Yeah, lovely. Keep it round to get as many harvestable resources as possible. Right, so back to the grain farming, because we've got 
Still got a bit of uh, bit of stuff to do there. All right, there we go. Right, bring that up. I wonder if I can fit the trees in there now. You see, we can fit little trees in, like birch trees, pines. What about spruce? So they're more sort of... Is it because the oaks are so wide? Yeah. We'll go with birch then. There we go. Pop them down the middle. Alright, I'm not doing it particularly neatly. Just sort of slapping them down at a rough... Do these trees grow or are they going to stay tiny, do you reckon? I hope they grow, because that would look quite good. There we go, a little bit of that. Again, not too neatly, because I want it to look reasonably natural. Well, it's not going to look natural at all, is it? But you know what I mean. So if we stick them there. And what I would also like to do, in terms of the power, we could stick... Like a windmill. There we go. Just just put a windmill on the there. You know, because why not? Another one there. Another one there. Just to just to make a little bit. Because that's the sort of thing you see. That looks proper farmlandish, doesn't it? Right. Okay. Can we? You're okay there. You're producing a fair amount. To be fair, we've actually got another. Uh, hang on. What have we got? So we can put some more farms up here. Right, so that was a grain farm. This can be our, uh, our farm there. There we go. So bring you down there with your field malarkey. So we'll just make a little, little bit like that around the wind farm. The wind turbine, the windmill, whatever you wish to call it. There we go, so that's your carrot farming and the uh, the cotton farming there, that's uh, another good one. Right, we'll uh, get that there, lovely. Down there, lovely, and again, leave a little gap. Bring it straight down and round just like that. couple of trees again up there just to really do we get some sort of a reward at the bottom corner some award from steam I don't know if planted trees I'm quite happy with our little farming area you know I like that no more uh, no more area down there is there so what we'll do is these non areas here so where this is here, I'm going to bring a road off here, because this could actually connect down there. We don't need to know what that does just yet, do we? But we could have another road sort of coming up here. Like that. So this could all be chicken farming. We could have a real sort of massive, massive area. I wonder how that's going to work with the production that we're, uh, we're doing at the moment. Right, another chicken farm. Let's, uh, let's stick that. Let's stick that a bit further that way. That's going to look good. Right, okay. So, another... Another sort of... Hang on, what am I doing here? Right. It's not what I meant to do. Right, where's the where's the doodah? Right, drag you into position. Yeah. Same again. Bit of that. You can come down here. It is so much easier not using the... Uh, the clipping, snapping, clipping. Gonna keep calling it that, aren't I? Right, so if we put you there, we can then put a little, little path between the two. Lovely. And it sort of looks like paths that maybe farmers could use, doesn't it?
Right, if we bring you out to the roadside there. Put that there. Yeah, lovely. Up the side. Keep getting that little bit of TLC achievement at the bottom there, which is nice. So I think we're going to build that to there. Yeah, that'll be nice. So we, we could build it round there, but I think what we're going to do, because we've got that forest there, that'd be nice to leave that untouched, wouldn't it? All right, where are our trees? More trees up there. This is the sort of thing that I don't really do, and picking up little tips like that off the internet are really, really good for just making your city look that little bit nicer. I'm not really... I'm, my builds are very much functional, aren't they? When you look at Transport Fever, I don't spend an awful lot of time decorating. There we go. So if we have that down there, that's looking really, really good. Right, a couple more. Should we have a few more wind farms? Self-sustainable, really, isn't it, when you think? I wonder how many cars are using this. A fair few. What's this? Horse box. Caravan. Lovely. Lovely stuff. I mean, I don't know how people are going to get here for work. This doesn't seem that bad, to be honest with you. I, I sort of feared that you'd come off here and the, the level crossing would be down and traffic would be... Oh, hang on. What's going on here? There's a car on fire. Wow. I didn't realise that cars could catch fire as well as houses, but apparently they can. Are we... Uh, fire engine's dispatched. Where is he? Oh, he's quite a way away, good lord. He's, uh, he's not so much in a rush, is he? Look at that, taking his time. I suppose if you... He's not really going faster than any, any of the uh, other cars, is he? For goodness sake. That car's going to be a burnt out husk by the time he gets there. Get out of the way, come on, move. They don't seem that bothered, do they? Oh, the traffic. Ah, because it's a car. I mean, it seems like it's burnt down. Only a pile of ash remains. I would beg to differ. This car is very much still in pristine condition. It's like it's just left the workshop. Hmm. Right, well, we'll ignore that problem. Oh, shall we have? Where's the, the nearest sort of medical... We've got a medical situation going on. We haven't got anything medical there. Medical clinic there. Medical clinic there. How about fire? We've got a fireplace there. And then the nearest fire station is there. So it would make more sense... ...to have a, a firehouse here. And a police station. Do you know what? We'll have both. Just to keep our city nice and safe. Now, so we're going to have uh, another another farm. Does it actually cost to put the farm down? I don't think it does, does it? Oh, what's that? Why has it just disappeared? Livestock farming. There we go. Right, so we're going to put this up here. There we go. Put that round the back. Just a little farm. Yeah, I don't think it costs anything, does it? So we'll we'll put that there. Then we'll leave the forest here. That can be quite nice. I might add some more trees to that, to be honest with you. Because it'd look... Uh, right, there we go. Birch. Of course, mine doesn't look as good as what the... Uh, it'd be nice. Can you... Is there some sort of... There's no, like, random tree assigner, is there? Like, we can, we can pop a load of them in there. There we go, a load of that, yeah, lovely. We could actually 
you know, you can understand why people get a repetitive strain injury doing stuff like this, don't you? Chestnut tree, a couple of them around there. There we go, keep that. Because then we can have another farm in this corner, can't we? There we go, keep them all. I mean, these trees are massive, aren't they? So, the, obviously, the other trees that we've planted should grow. What about a couple of, uh, couple of spruces just round, just for the... Uh, just for effect. Lovely. There we go. Right. Have all that. Bit of that. Ah, lovely. Nice little field there. We might leave that with no trees and I think that looks half decent. I wonder how the... Um, let's have a look at our finances. How's that working with the uh, production side of things? Right, well, we're still in a deficit because I really want to pr be producing more. I mean, we're in a surplus for logs... Vegetables and cotton, we, we are in a deficit still. Chicken, we're still in a tiny deficit. But again, we can this can all be filled with farmland. Don't know so much about that, but like we could get rid of this particular area and have this as all city, because it does seem a bit, you know, with this area growing here, it seems a bit out of place, doesn't it, compared to the other areas. I do like the idea of having more logging around there, but we've got loads of logging here, haven't we? It's probably why we've got, uh, we're in a... Oh, hang on. We've got this. See, this is near the motorway, isn't it? How's it working with traffic now? Traffic's working much better here. Obviously, that's always going to be a little bit of a, a little bit of a narrow section, isn't it? Traffic around the city hall also looking really, really good. That said, it is 4:35 in the morning. Let's have a look. Where's the uh, Where's the old traffic? Traffic there. Okay, so these are the. Uh, the worst areas for it in the city, obviously, when you get out here. There are a lot of orange areas, flipping heck. Yeah, too many junctions is something we need to work on, isn't it? Hmm. I also think, like, the, the cars and things that are going over the level crossings, maybe bridges would be better. I really like that. I think that's that's really nice. We have some more farming round here, down down all this road here, just to split it up a little bit. But yeah, I quite like the you know the little paths in between. It just splits it up, makes it look a bit nicer. I mean, to be fair, with this little farm here, we could have done something a bit more, couldn't we? But I mean, employees are looking good. Plenty of people. We could also have a bus network, couldn't we? Coming from a little local bus running from here. Alright, bus line tool, create a new route starting there. There we go, we can come all the way up here. EU bus stop shelter, there we go. Slap that there, lovely. Another one there, lovely. Right, okay, so what were we doing with that other bus route that I've just not finished? Try again, create a new route, lovely, route, lovely, up there, right, that's going to be really easy, one, two, three, four, five, six, uh, where are we going, are we going like a circular around town or, no, we'll go back down the main street, go up there, yeah, lovely, and back round again, and that is our newest bus line, bus line 11, we're going to change it to have as minimum buses on as possible and two pound a ticket that should be fine should be absolutely fine right well that is where we're going to leave it for today i hope you enjoyed that if you did please do click the like button always appreciated and if you haven't already do make sure you subscribe so that you never miss out on any future episodes do let me know in the comments if you've got any great ideas for the city as without you guys our city would be rubbish because uh, i'm terrible at thinking up new ideas but uh, yeah thanks so much for watching and hopefully i'll see you all next time cheerio Goodbye for now.